Hey, it's Karina, and this is your bikini yoga routine. This is one of my very favorite workouts to do with you during the bikini series, so follow along. begin at the top of our mat take a deep breath in exhale hands to heart and again exhale hands to heart extend arms overhead fall forward flat back step or jump back into a plank position and chaturanga, upward dog, and downward. Stay here in your first downward facing dog. Walk out your heels. Get all the kinks out of your body. Move your hips around your neck. Once you feel good, go into a still position. A few breaths in and out. Now we'll come up onto our tippy toes, bend your knees, step or jump forward to the mat, flat back, fold, and arms up to the sky, and palms to your heart. Repeat that a couple more times. Fall forward, flat back, jump or step back to your chaturanga, and lower to the ground, Upward dog and downward. Deep breaths here. And we're going to repeat that one more time all on our own. Now that we're meeting in downward facing dog, up on our toes, slight bend in the knees, spring forward to the top of your mat, flat back, fold, arms up to the sky, and to your heart. Arms up again as we come into a chair position and hold, weight is in the back of your heels, good, hold it here. Now we'll slowly lower to the ground, coming into a boat position. And we're gonna work those abs. Let's extend and up. For eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, last one. Cross your ankles, come forward on your palms, and step back into a plank position. Lower your knees, three tricep push-ups. Plank position, chaturanga, and meet in downward facing dog. Couple breaths here. Now, I want you to bring your right knee to your chest and back, left knee to chest and back, right and left, and we're gonna speed it up for 10. Ready? And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Downward dog. Now we'll bring our right foot in between our hands, lower the back heel, come up into a warrior one, 
hold it here. Left hand comes down onto the ground, twisting it open, and then we're coming into a side plank and hold. Arm can extend over your ear if you like for a nice side stretch. Holding, lift your hips up, don't let them sink. Come back into a plank position, knees lower, and three tricep push-ups. And then chaturanga and meet in downward facing dog. Left side, foot comes forward, right heel down to the ground. Warrior one. Right hand comes down to the ground. And now come into the side plank on the opposite side. Come into a plank position, knees down, three tricep push-ups. Plank, chaturanga, and downward dog. All right, and downward dog, we're gonna do the downward dog run again. Ready for 10 and 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Now we'll step our right foot forward, coming into warrior two. And go through your chaturanga. And left side, left foot steps forward, open up into warrior two. Cartwheel your hands down. Go through your vinyasa. Right foot comes forward. Open up into warrior two again. Flip your front hand. Come into a reverse warrior. Straighten that front leg. Come forward into a triangle pose. back into your reverse warrior and cartwheel your hands down and go through your vinyasa. Other side, left foot comes forward, warrior two. Flip your front hand, reverse your warrior. Straighten the front leg. Come up into a triangle pose. Reverse your warrior again. And go through your vinyasa. Do the running downward dog again. Ready for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Downward dog. Jump or hop forward. Flat back and fold. Arms up to the sky and at your heart. Fold, jump back into your plank, lower your knees, and three tricep push-ups. And 10, 9, 
and go through your vinyasa. From here, we'll lower down into a dolphin pose, so come on your forearms. Now lower your hips, come to a forearm plank and hold it here. Now come into a plank and lower and through your vinyasa. Up onto your toes, slight bend in the knee, jump or step forward, flat back, fold, arms up to the sky. Now we'll come into a chair position hands at your heart and we're doing a twisting chair to the right. And chair position, keep holding it right there, palms back together and twist to the opposite side. down and fold forward. Flat back and go into your vinyasa. A few deep breaths here. Now bend your knees, jump forward, land on your butt legs are extended in front. Deep breath in and folding forward. Fold as far as you can go and relax. Just let it all out. And sit back up. Bend your right leg into your thigh. Extend your arms overhead and fold forward. And release, we'll switch sides. Left leg hugs in. Extend your arms overhead and fold forward. up, bring your feet together, come into a butterfly position, and you can use your elbows to kind of push down on your thighs. This is a great stretch to do if you just finished cat's inner and outer thigh workout. It'll feel really good. Now we're going to stretch your glutes. So let's come in a cross-legged position. Put your right ankle on top of your left leg here just put, um, in between your knee and your hip. Now you can stay here, you should feel the stretch right in here. Or if you're a little more flexible or it feels all right, you can fold forward. And come up, let's switch sides. into a cross-legged position. Let's do one last final twist to each side. Deep breath in. As you exhale, twist deeper. And release to the other side. Deep breath in. And exhale.
thank you for joining me on the beach for bikini yoga. This is a great routine to squeeze in any time of the day or pair with any of your other tone it up workouts. Let's take three deep breaths together. Make sure you check in on Instagram, Twitter, and the community whenever you do this workout. Namaste. runs by. He could be kind of cute. Okay. And fold. Arms up and we'll come up. Come into a your bring your what are these? <laughs> Feet? I know a lot of you will want to know where this yoga outfit's from and it's from Lorna Jane and we'll put a link in the information below.